Well, I'm unboxing the Kaival uh, stick vacuum today. It's a cordless one. Um, I had been looking around for a replacement for my Shark Navigator, which I like, but uh, it's very heavy. Anyway, let's open this. I haven't opened it yet, so I'm not sure what I'm going to see. Okay, so there's a manual. User manual. Oh, this would be, looks like it would be a mount to mount the, the vacuum and the parts. So that's what that is. And here's the main guts of the vacuum. This is the, uh, the motor part. So once it's charged up, um, oh, it is charged up. <laughs> um, you hook it onto the sticks. Let me see if I can find them. So that would be the handle. Nice pretty red color. That would hook onto that. And here are the attachments. This is kind of exciting. I love vacuuming. <laughs> I love cleaning. Okay, so that's one of the attachments. It would hook onto the main part and it would run a little brush. Can't wait to try all this stuff out. And here's the main the main beater bar. It says it has LED lights that come on. So that would hook on to the stick part. This looks like a, a filter. Keep the dust out. Keep the dust from flying out. And this is a looks like a furniture brush. Yes. So, oh, that looks good. Oh, that looks like it would be great for upholstery. Okay, so that's everything out of the box. Um, these are the, yeah, so this is the part that you hang on the wall and you can hang up your unit. There's the plug. So you plug that in plug into the wall, it charges up the battery, and uh, we're good to go. So I'm going to play with this, I'm going to have fun, try it out, and see what I like and don't like about it. And I'll see you in, uh, in a week, I guess, after I try this out for a while. Okay, so my battery is all charged up. I'll turn it on for a sec, and you'll see the three blue lights are lit up, so that means it's fully charged. I'll also show this other uh, power button um, for the vacuum. It has three levels of suction. That would be high, low, and medium. So I'm probably going to use it on high most of the time, uh, but there might be reasons for, for using a, a lower level. This is the upholstery attachment. It um, has the brush like that, a nice firm brush, or you can use it flat like that. There, that snaps on super easy, like that. And let's try it out on this chair. And that'll get any little bits of dust. You can't see dust on upholstery, but you know it's there. If it's on its floor, on your floors, it's going to be on your chairs too. So I like that. Very good. Take that off, just like that. If you wanted to use it the other way, same thing. You like that? Good suction. Really good suction. Yeah, that works well too. 
excellent. So I've changed my uh, tool. Uh, this is the crevice tool to get along the edges of your cupboards and underneath your your furniture and stuff. Here we go. We'll go across to this side. Excellent. Yep. Very good. Yeah, I like that. It's nice and strong and quiet. I like the quietness of this machine. Okay, let's give this another go on my outdoor lanai carpet. And it starts out on the medium, so you'd press it one button up to go on to the high level of suction. I'll show you that later. Yeah, that's sucking all the little bits of dirt up. Very good. I like that. So the button I was talking about is up, up here. Uh, there's three lines, so high, medium, and low suction. I've found that when you turn the machine on, it goes to the medium. So press it to go to the high button if you want. Like that. So I've taken the, the wand off. I want to show you all this dirt that I've picked up in just uh, a few minutes of, of going around the house. I'm going to press this button, this is a little trap door, to empty the, the dirt out. So here we go. And boom, it goes in. Just give a little tap. Close it back up and you're good to go. So I've played around with this quite a bit. I'm pretty impressed with it. Um, I've shown you a lot of things. The one uh, tool that I didn't show you was this motorized tool. I would use this for probably my mattress. Um, that's the kind of thing I like to really suck out the, the dust and, and uh, dust mites and stuff. Uh, so I didn't use that one. So there's an, an air filter underneath this cap. Underneath this cap there's a HEPA filter. They, they give you an extra one. Um, so all those things I really like. Uh, it's so lightweight. Um, the only thing I wasn't sure on, when you're vacuuming and you have to stop and, and move something, you have to lay your, your vacuum down on the floor. You can't, it doesn't stand up by itself. So that was really the one thing that I, I could only criticize for. Um, my husband's going to put this up for me, the uh, holder. You put your tools on the sides and your vacuum hangs on this little hook there. So I'm liking it. I'm liking it a lot. Uh, and uh, it sure is a lot easier to lug around the house than, than my old uh, shark. Thanks for watching.